Good morning, everybody. Mom H with Honey Hollow Homestead. Okay. She is about finished. Okay. I have some fasteners that I've ordered online. Some are going to be here on Friday and some are going to be here on Monday. I was hoping they'd be coming at the same time, but no. So... I will show you what I've got done. All the bolts down here are tightened. There's the, uh, the toe rings. Each toe ring is rated for 2,200 pounds. Okay? This thing is not going to be moved with hay in it. It will only be moved when it's empty. Haven't tried moving it yet. But all the bolts are tightened. Okay. Back panel's on. This is the fence I had to use. I did not have enough of the um, sheep and goat panel to do a section here. So I'm hoping that this uh, wire, this is a welded wire fence and I will secure it very well when the connectors get here, the fasteners. Um, in the meantime, I just have the zip ties here, just kind of hold it in place. Okay. But everything is tight, except for that last section. Uh, here's the latches. Got another one on the other side. Okay. Here we go. Gate okay, goes down. It's clear for them for the round bale to be put in the cradle. Okay. Uh I do have, I've got to cut this off. I just saw that. Okay. I cut that one piece a little bit too high. So that's easy enough to do. I can get that with the grinder. Um, other than that, just waiting those connectors. And this thing will be ready, hopefully, to be relocated into the pasture and ready for the first round bale. Now, somebody had mentioned, and I think it's a valid point, that they were not too sure about how the pocket hole screws were going to work. Okay, there they are, right there, okay. Uh, even though I've got four on each end, I also have, I don't know if you see in this shadow, I'm gonna get it on the other side, on both ends, Okay, I've got these, um, there's some kind of a extra strength screw, uh, it's very long, I think they're like 10 inches long, going through on, on all, all four posts into that, so I'm hoping that gave it extra strength, and, uh, we'll see if it looks like it's, uh, a little iffy if I hear cracking. We'll see. So you figure a round bale weighs about a thousand pounds. Okay. Um, the wood I know can handle it. The pocket hole screws, I'm not sure. This is also held up with the wire on this end. Okay, this one. On this end, not so much, but this cattle panel wiring will help to hold it up, okay? And so this side has not just the four on either end, it has four more on either end up here too. So,
So until I get those connectors, those fasteners, she's done. And we'll see if she works. Um, if I had more of those uh, really long screws, I would have put a couple more in there. But at least there's one in each one. So, Mom H with Honey Hollow Homestead. She's done until the weekend. Talk to y'all later.